Speaking of music, you do have a new project out. Yeah. Called Coma. Mm -hmm. What's the meaning behind that title there? Uh, shit, the meaning behind the title is basically like the definition. And I say I can't tell you the definition verbatim, but I know like when you're in a coma, like you're not, you're not coherent. You know what I'm saying? Like you there, but you're not there. And that's basically why I, it's how I feel. Like people doing my music. You feel me? Like my songs were there, but like niggas went clicking, like jumping over them. So I just like I won't let niggas know. Like shit, I'm still here, man. I'm coherent. I see y'all not fucking with me. You feel me? So it was more so like that state of mind. I just wanted to make sure we had like a five track list to make sure I could back up with shit, the name, because the coma was gonna bring like a lot of adversity anyway. You feel me? Like, damn, why you name it coma? And everybody named mama know what the definition of coma is. And I feel like that's just why I was at in my career at the time. Like, niggas ain't, ain't niggas think I'm dead. Like, but I ain't even dead, you feel me? Like, I felt like I was in the hospital. And niggas wouldn't even come to check on me. Yeah. That's what my mind state was at, you feel me? What was the reaction when you uh, first put out that artwork? on social media? Oh man, when we first put out the artwork, the artwork was crazy. And then everybody really was like DMing people around me like, is Quan okay? Is he really okay? Then like, I had other people like, oh that's hard. I like the way you going with it. It makes sense, you feel me? And like, I wouldn't even call it like a rebirth. I just felt like, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh Quan, you fell off. Nah, man, I fell back, you feel me? Like, you feel me, I fell back. And I feel, I feel like now, the game is getting back. It's, it's, Transitioning back over to real music, like it's coming back over to lyrics a little bit. It's doing it slowly, but it's coming over. So I was like, now might be the right time. And when we drop, like we're not really out at the time. I mean, we got a great little feedback. Great, but still getting great feedback off of it. You know what I'm saying? Do you look at this particular project as like a mixtape or an album? Um, I look at it as a mixtape. And the only reason I say a mixtape, man, only because like a lot of the songs were already done. And we just want to collectively put like something that makes sense together, that go, goes with the coma, with what I'm talking about, you feel me? Like with the album, like, we ain't really do no thought process on it. This is what we want to do, we want to put some music out. You know what I mean? Let's get a fan somewhere quick. So I just say like an EP, you feel me, something like that. And I, I don't know I, I don't, don't call it the album, because like, we haven't had no promo behind it. We didn't have a budget on it, you know what I'm saying? It's just something we want to put out with. Like I say, this is my first time being independent, man. It's so long, so it's like the first time, really the first project, I really could just, Benefit everything off of you feel me? I ain't got a car no label. Ask can I drop this? I paid all my producers. I don't saw how the labels work, so I'm just do everything they do out my own pocket. I want to let my fans know like one thing is like I really put the coma project out for y'all like for y'all and myself just to let like y'all know I ain't gave up. You feel me? And myself to let myself know like these niggas can't fuck with me. Just what I'm telling myself like these niggas can't fuck with you. They ain't doing nothing different that you can't do. You started a lot of this shit. And like I say, I really just want to drop it. Give it to my fans and let them know, like, I promised y'all I wasn't going to start going in. And I like, said, that's my promise. You feel me? And I ain't want nobody to think like I just quit, like I just gave up. You feel me? Like, I'm from Atlanta. That shit's going to be hard and that to make me stop this shit. I got to go out on the deathbed or something. You feel me? So that was just my whole thing. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't, I don't really voice myself like that. You know what I mean? I ain't social friendly. So if that's anything, it'll be that, you know what I'm saying? I did this shit for my fans and for myself. Did you, when you released the project uh, and uh, it came out in December, I forgot what date technically it was released on. Was it the... The, the 13th, the, the whatever, 13th. yeah, the Friday. Friday, Friday the 13th. 13th, yeah. So was that on purpose, Friday the 13th? Was it on purpose to do it close to Christmas? Was, or was this one of those projects, it was supposed to come out two, three months prior and it just got delayed and yeah. you ended up dropping it in December? Be honest, like, man, that shit was supposed to come out, like, some months ago. You know what I mean? We had been had it in ready. Like I said, we had been taking care of the business. And when I say taking care of the business, that's mean everybody had been paid. You know what I mean? It was just more so, like I say, just really just waiting on that right time when you just felt like, all right, enough is enough. Let's just do it. But it was not planned to be on Friday the 13th. It was not planned to be in December. It felt like shit. I was ready for reactions. You feel me? I was ready to stroke my ego again. You feel me? You know, as an artist, sometimes, man, we need, it be them little stuff, man, that just boost our confidence, you know what I'm saying, that, that'll have us from here. It'll be that one, you know what I'm saying, that one thing that just take us from here, have me back feeling like the man when I walk through. You feel me? So once I did, once we dropped it, like, like I say, man, a lot of the music, like, we had been taking care of the business on it, and when it dropped, the reaction to the show, like, okay, my idea sound good with this. I'm sure you got, uh, several amounts of comments. Yeah. I do want to get comments from people watching this that have yeah. heard 
yeah. coma yeah, and place too. a comment right now and, and let you know what they actually think and yeah. be 100% honest. I hate you, man. Don't sugarcoat anything. <laughs>